I'm already Amidst coronavirus a guy lockdowns, that is Michael gay. Douglas announces his new podcast. Oh, no, great. Uh, shut up. Mm-hmm. For real? Yes. For, it's me. Yes. <laughs> friend of the show. I have my own podcast now with my co host Adam. Yeah. <laughs> who's a gay man. <laughs> Stop uh, it. Would you just stop it? <laughs> Would you just fucking stop it? Chill out. So, Michael, what do you think of that RNC? That's I think go- you should stop. Okay. I think, you should, <laughs> I think you should watch your fucking mouth. <laughs> what do I have to do? Do I have to wash your fucking mouth out with cum? <laughs> like Not your, again, Michael. Like your boyfriends. Please. What exactly do I have to do? Michael, you are my boyfriend. Do I have boyfriend. to wash your mouth out with shit? <laughs> Do I have to make love to your mouth with my ass? Right? <laughs> my ass. My, my ass. ass. And I put my ass up to your mouth. <laughs> yes. It's sexy. <laughs> it's sexy. <laughs> it feels so sexy. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Yes, sir. Boy, I put my ass up, my to, your ass up to your lips. <laughs> <laughs> it's sexy. It's sexy. <laughs> oh God, it's so funny. Is that the way it feels? It feels sexy to have my ass on your lips. <laughs> is he really starting a podcast? No. Oh, that would be no. This is I a mean, movie where he's in a law firm and he keeps making he keeps making nine hundred number phone calls. Yes. And he gets addicted to them. Right. And I it's fucking that. up his ability to be a lawyer. Because mm-hmm. he's too he's jacking so, yeah, off too white much. shoe <laughs> high power Manhattan yeah. lawyer. He's on party lines. I got a call with my client in three minutes. <laughs> but I gotta do something first. <laughs> Put my ass in the <laughs> It's so sexy. It's sexy when I hit in your mouth. <laughs> Michael, uh, some of the partners are kind of worried about how much time you've been spending on the phone lately. Listen, they pulled the logs, and they saw who you were calling. Now, it's not a big deal, but maybe you want to save that for after hours. Why don't you mind your own goddamn business, Scott? Why don't you mind your fucking Fuck business? You. Fuck you, Scott. Fuck you. I'm the best goddamn Don't forget liar. who's won the most cases. Who wins the br- who's the breadwinner here? Good afternoon. You're listening to Michael Douglas and Ashton Kutcher. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this is fucking older women. Dude, podcast. Ashton, this I is gotta... the older pussy podcast. <laughs> Ashton did the right. Th- did he played De- Demi Moore's pussy like it was stocks? Yeah. He fucking got it at its all time high. Ashton, let me ask you this. Got out before the crash, and now he's fucking. If you haven't put your your butt cheeks up to (laughs) Demi Moore's pussy, (laughs) how did it feel? (laughs) How did it feel? Feel feel good? (laughs) Feel good to feel that? The Ashton Kutcher's not even there. Yeah. (laughs) I'm I'm doing a text to speech email. (laughs) Dear Ashton. Demi's bush, <laughs> big thick bush all over your ass. <laughs> now he's shitting your, in her pussy, saying, <laughs> putting his ass up to a pussy. Just what you say to me, I'm going to be wiped. I'm a baby, and I want you to wipe me. Wipe me with your bush, Demi. <laughs> Ashton Goodrich's like, yeah, I think I got an email from Michael Douglas. <laughs> Uh, this is know, weird, weird though yeah we're maybe, sending maybe emails. got hacked we're sending emails on air I mean, you're listening to <laughs> the michael douglas punked podcast <laughs> and who better to punk for the first episode <laughs> than ashton <laughs> dear ashton <laughs> i raped Demi. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good punk. That's a good punk saying you raped someone's ex wife. <laughs> send the email. <laughs> Siri, send it. Siri, send the email. Okay. Here's what do you want yeah. me to say? Dear Ashton, mm-hmm. I raped a me. Yeah. Ready to send? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Your email says, Dear Ashton, I raped your wife. <laughs> Ready to send? <laughs> yes, send it. <laughs> Fax that over to me. Fax it from my office. <laughs> send it. Send it. Yes. Send it with high urgency. My <laughs> it's, got a, it's got a little exclamation point in red next to it. <laughs> in Outlook. This is crazy. I got a email from you. 
from the desk of Michael he Douglas. Says he raped <laughs> my wife. <laughs> oh, wait, I got an email. I don't know what Ashton Kutcher sounds. <laughs> That's like. good. Yeah, he yeah. sounds like Putty. Yeah, it's uh, oh, uh this is uh, Ashton Kutcher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I uh, changed my voice. <laughs> Was projected under my ass <laughs> as, as uh, the first billion dollars I made in film I spent on the world's tiniest projector, <laughs> so I could have Citizen Kane projected directly under my asshole every minute of every day. <laughs> and this is this is what makes me. Such and a then you went into uh, day, the weekly political satire, Michael. Afterwards, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and then you purchased the Patriot Act and played and then, it on your asshole. And then people got bored of Citizen Kane. <laughs> <laughs> so we watched the, the song of a <laughs> People were like, this is great. Yeah. We love watching stuff off your ass, yeah, Michael. It <laughs> Did it involve Hassan Minaj? You have to get very close <laughs> to see it, the screen. <laughs> Because Hassan is the same color as my shit. Oh, okay. uh, Michael, that's a, that's come rude. on, Michael. It's not racist. It's a fact. <laughs> Michael, and, chill out, right, man. Ju- that's how an ass works. <laughs> but you my poop ass. races. I don't. <laughs> yeah, you have a dial and you set it to different colors. Dear Siri, send an email to Hassan. <laughs> New email to Hassan. <laughs> this is Michael Douglas. <laughs> I was watching a show on my ass. <laughs> and <I> took it. <laughs> As you know, I have the world's tiniest projector. <laughs> Everyone knows that. And that. As everybody knows. And we did a bit where you come out of the curtain, which is my hemorrhoids. <laughs> and I got from having my ass... Licked <laughs> by Catherine after she spent the afternoon trying out new salsas. Uh, Even so. Michael Douglas thinks she's Hispanic. <laughs> <laughs> she keeps it. People Latina tell me she's Welsh, by, but I don't know. Yeah, Mexican wife. Keep her Latina <laughs> flavor by eating hot sauce all the time. And sometimes, <laughs> she, sometimes the hot sauce is still on her tongue when she eats my ass. Wow, that's so extreme. So uh, red. <laughs> like curd. I, I can't wait for people to be like, well, they said ridiculous stuff about Patriot Act. And then right in the middle of it, it's <laughs> Catherine Zeta Jones <laughs> eating salsa out of his ass. I, was, I had a bunch of friends over to watch Citizen Kane. <laughs> Oh my, yeah. Halfway through, I took a shit, and everyone said, "What is this Patriot Act with Hassan Minaj?" <laughs> is that what we're watching? Is that what oh, because the show is shitty. No, because no. it, oh, it's oh, a okay. curtain. I, I was trying to give you a, it's a curtain, uh, and he's coming out of the curtain. <laughs> Jesus, and the curtain is your hemorrhoids. Uh huh. <laughs> serious. Just send, like my dick is small. Send a new email to Ashton. Dear Ashton, I'm sorry about raping your wife. Would you like to come over and watch Citizen King? <laughs> <laughs> you know I've got the world's tiniest projector. I've spent a, a billion dollars on it. So wait, I'm so confused. <laughs> Michael, you actually did rape his uh, wife? Yes. <laughs> I thought you were punking him by That's pretending. Not a, well, the punk was the, that she the was raped. The punk was the rape, not yeah. the email. To really hurt his feelings. I don't understand how pranks work. No. <laughs> the, the, Honestly, Michael, yeah. I think you should be arrested and taken to the mm-hmm. police. Michael, that's yeah, that's pretty messed up. Robbie's got himself a golden globe, so mm-hmm. they can suck his golden nuts. Well, I've got a golden... I have a different kind of golden globe. <laughs> <laughs> what kind is it, Michael? I don't want to tell. <laughs> Do you put it in it. your ass? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. I was hoping people wouldn't figure it out. Well, it has the planet on it. Is it like the award, or is it just a big golden? I have ball? a set of anal beads that have, or each of the individual planets, in order from the sun <laughs> to Pluto. In well, order, you started order the sun. Of size. Yeah, you started the sun. That's the, the sun, the biggest, the one. biggest one. You put that one in your ass the first. The sun goes in your ass first. <laughs> You, That's you were, so much bigger wow. than the other ones. And I was arrested <clears throat> at the Ben Franklin Institute in Philadelphia for trying to show it to children in the gift <laughs> shop. 
<laughs> was it because there was still shit on it? And uh, and that caused problems at my job at the law firm, <laughs> which is the, pl- oh, right. the plot of my new film, Philadelphia 2, <laughs> even gay. <at> <laughs> It's true. More AIDS. That was my issue the first time I saw that movie. Yeah. It wasn't gay. The though. opening scene of, 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 uh, yeah, it's Philadelphia directed by Sidney Lumet. <laughs> the opening scene is Tom Hanks is sweating in a jail cell. Right. And, uh, Denzel is his public defender. Right. That shows up and he's like, so what's going on? I read in the police report you were putting the entire solar system in your ass at the Ben Franklin Institute. <laughs> Yeah. So this is Tom like, Hanks after the events of the first. No, this is just a redoing of Philadelphia. A reimagining, a reimagining where it's gayer. Yeah, where it's Philadelphia, directed by Sidney Lumet, where Tom Hanks is sweating in a jail cell. Uh-huh. The late Sidney Lumet. And he's, uh, you know, Denzel's assigned this case, and he's like, you're looking at first degree sexual misconduct, you know. Right. There's not really any, you know, he doesn't want the case. He's homophobic. Of course. He doesn't want to deal with this guy. And then Tom Hanks is like, ah, <clears throat> uh, Denzel, uh, listen. <laughs> um, I'm gay. <laughs> I'm, uh-huh. a, I'm a fag, uh, if you will. Uh, how does he talk? It's kind of there. Yeah. Yeah, so Michael fine. Douglas is not in it, though. Uh uh, I put things in my ass. It's what I do. Uh, so Louis C.K. No, it's, <laughs> yeah. from, it's from the twisted mind of Michael Douglas. Right. Yeah. He reimagines He's the auteur. Yeah. I'm, I'm writing a movie for my good friend, Sidney Lumet, to direct. <laughs> you have to excuse me. I'm not very good at impressions. <laughs> Oh, that was Michael yeah. talking. And so Denzel shows up and he's like, man, Damn. how you going to be putting shit in your ass, man? And Michael, Michael I, that really doesn't that. sound like Denzel. Well, yeah. From my memory. <laughs> from memory, that's true. I've met him dozens of and times. And so then <laughs> Tom Hanks says, uh, oh, what's up, pork chop? <laughs> yeah. you know, one of his classic lines. <laughs> One of his famous gay lines. <laughs> <laughs> Philadelphia. Wow. That's awesome, Mike. Mm-hmm. Imagine putting a spoiler on your asshole yep. right. so you can fuck faster. Mm-hmm. Imagine having a spoiler. <laughs> They, uh, they, there's, they're adding me into the. I've requested to be put into the Fast and the Furious movies. <laughs> but he has a spoiler. <laughs> but it's just Michael Douglas running with a spoiler and sticking out of his ass. <laughs> so he and we're, re- we're renaming it Fast and Loose. <laughs> Ooh, I like so that. Yeah, yeah. Fast, fast and loose. Nine, Fast and Loose. We're not just fast, we're loose. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, Michael is furious. Michael Douglas, fully nude, with a pair of New Balance running sneakers, <laughs> yeah. and there's a spoiler coming a spoiler out. Spoiler his ass and he's out. running really fast. And it says BlueChew.com. <laughs> yeah. Spoiler. Oh, yeah. The, he's oiled up. The official NASCAR yeah. BlueChew mm-hmm. car. Bust as quickly as possible. A lot of people ask me, Michael, how is it possible that you had sex with 10,000 women? And it's because I have not... In one pump immediately. <laughs> because there's a spoiler coming out of my ass. That's sponsored by Bluetooth. <laughs> That's kind of like their Red Bull. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Re- Dreamcasting. Yeah. Yeah. Michael Douglas is red. red. Yeah. That'd be great. What are you guys doing down here? Smoking pot? <laughs> You'll try cocaine. <laughs> Don't come upstairs. You two me. come with me. Just takes Jackie and fucking uh, yeah. Donna with him. Me and the bald neighbor and his titty, big titty <laughs> wife are doing cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's just cocking. What's his yeah. name? Nobody come upstairs. Me and the bald neighbor's <laughs> big titted wife are doing cocaine. Together. <laughs> and we're having, we're making love. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a better show, man. Yeah. That'd be That's way an awesome show. <laughs> Listen, I need to get, uh, I need to get to Costco. Okay, and I need to speak to the manager. All right, because I was here last week, <laughs> and a Chinese woman was following me around, was copying. <laughs> copying every one of my purchases. <laughs> 
<laughs> that would be, Honestly, that would be that really would be funny. Anno- that would be annoying. Honestly. We should hire Chinese ladies to do that. That would be a good punk. That's a good punk. There was a Chinese lady copying all of my purchases. <laughs> and I said, excuse me, <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> I will rape you if you continue copying me. <laughs> Michael. Mike, stop raping people, stop man. It. That's not a punk. That's of fucked course, up. Of course, I would never do that. Didn't I you just, say you raped Ashton's I went wife, back to my car and I watched Citizen Kane. <laughs> <laughs> Your own ass? Oh, I, got I, a, I got a cosmetic hand mirror and I sat in my car watching Citizen Kane. <laughs> I, put my, I have stirrups next to the steering wheel. <laughs> I actually have a. <laughs> I got. I have a special vehicle. The way my second, people drive. My second billion dollars I mm-hmm. made in in film I spent on a Maserati with stirrups on the steering wheel from a gynecologist's <laughs> office, and I drive the car with my ass. <laughs> on a steering wheel, so I can watch Citizen Kane in a mirror while I drive. And it's a mirror that's pointed at your ass to be clear. So you get, There's you get, a mirror on the steering wheel, mm-hmm. which also has stirrups, so I can watch Tiny Citizen Kane <laughs> while driving the car with my legs. Oh, okay. Do you get it projected backwards so in the mirror it looks the right way? What a ridiculous question. <laughs> <laughs> You're being ridiculous. I'm sorry. You're being absolutely ridiculous. I was just, okay, I was just thinking about how you could... You're ruining the movie. All right. <laughs> I just Why? want to make sure you're you not. Stop watching... distracting me. I'm trying to drive. I just want to make. Sure... <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to watch Citizen Kane and drive. <laughs> yeah, that movie was pretty good, honestly. Yeah, I thought it was going to be bad. I remember re- watching it in college with my boy and being like, "This is going to suck." Yeah, and it was good. And he's and like, "We're just we're just putting something on to get comfortable with each other." <laughs> And I'm like, all okay, right, stop, relax. <laughs> okay, Owen, I will. Yeah. Stop. We're just, just, we're just gonna have a. Hey, <laughs> you don't need to get upset. All right, I'm sorry. We're just putting a movie on. Throw, throw it on. It's a couple fine. of guys watching Citizen Kane. <laughs> you're, you're sexy. I'm sexy. <laughs> Yeah, it feels weird at first. I know. I went through this with Michael Douglas. <laughs> wow. Listen, wow. He's I like the Galen. I was just a guy. I played lacrosse at University of Texas. <laughs> Suddenly, Michael Douglas comes through Austin. Everyone says, wow. Wow. That's Michael Douglas. Yeah, yeah. Wall Street. He's and he pulls famous. me aside and he says, you want to make a billion dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still, okay. Did you get a yeah, billion dollars? Or? I didn't. Yeah. Man. I didn't. Well, yeah, you know. We ended up just watching Citizen Kane. That's a good movie. 